Construction of Angles by Sector and Different Angles This module will explain construction of angles by sector and different angles. Angle by sector is the line that divides an angle in two equal paths. Let us learn the steps to construct angle by sector of a given angle. Let us draw angle by sector of a given angle A, O, B. Step 1. With O as center, draw a semicircle that cuts both the rays of the angle A, O, B at C and D respectively. Step 2. With C as center and radius more than half C, D, draw an arc in the interior of the angle. Step 3. With same radius, and D as center, draw an arc in the interior of the angle that cuts the previous arc at M. Then, OM is the required angle bisector. Let us now learn to draw some angles of specific measure. 1. 60 degree Step 1. Draw a line L of any measure. Step 2. Mark a point O on it. Step 3. With O as center, draw a semicircle of any radius. Let the semicircle cut the line at A. Step 4. With A as center and same radius, draw an arc that cuts the semicircle. Let it cut at B. Step 4. Join OB. Angle AOB is the required angle. 2. 120 degree. Step 1. Draw a line L of any measure. Step 2. Mark a point O on it. Step 3. With O as center, draw a semicircle of any radius. Let the semicircle cut the line at A. Step 4. With O as center and same radius, draw an arc that cuts the semicircle. Let it cut at B. Step 5. With B as center and same radius again, cut the semicircle at point C. Step 6. Join OC. Angle AOC is the required angle. Example. Draw an angle of 150 degrees. Explanation. To draw an angle of 150 degrees, we first construct 120 degrees angle and bisect the angle between 120 and 18 degrees to get 150 degrees. Let us see the steps of construction. Step 1. Draw a line L of any measure. Step 2. Mark a point O on it. Step 3. With O as center, draw a semicircle of any radius. Let the semicircle cut the line at A and D respectively. Step 4. With A as center and same radius, draw an arc that cuts the semicircle. Let it cut at B. Step 5. With B as center and same radius, again cut the semicircle at point C. Step 6. Join OC. This gives us 120 degrees. Step 7. With C as center, and radius that is more than half CD, draw an arc in interior of angle D, O, C. Step 8. With D as center and same radius, draw an arc in interior of angle D, O, C that cuts the previous arc at E. Step 9. Join OE. Angle A, O, E is the required angle. 